In the previous video, we were displaying a couple of books on the old books page. Let's go to the old books page. Here we are. Over here, you can see we are having one, two, three, four, five books, but the design is not good. What will happen if I will add more books in the service? Let's see how it will work then. So we have created a new service under this books module. Here we are in the services and this is the service that I have added for the books. Let's just copy few objects over here. Just copy and paste them again. Okay, just go back to the UI. Over here you can see that these books are getting updated in one single row. We have to update this design so that we can have a number of books on this particular page. For that, let's go to the component. Here we are in the old books component and this is the code that we have written to display the books. We are having this material card. This is the angular material card. Over here we are having this class that is the example card. And if I go to the corresponding CSS file, here we are. This is the maximum width for this particular card. This name doesn't look good like the example card. We can update it. So here I'm writing book card. Update the class over here also. Okay, now we have to write some CSS for this container. So in the container, first let's remove this flex direction. Remove this padding as well. And here let's use flex wrap. This is the flex designing. Here I'm writing wrap. Okay, and let's add one more CSS. So here I'm writing container. And this will be greater than strict. Here I'm writing flex. Then one, one. And the maximum width I want to keep that is 300 pixel. So here also we can update the width. Now we are having 400. So let's make it 300 just save all the changes and let's go back to the browser over here you can see we are having three books in one single row if i scroll down a little bit then you will see we are having three more books and this is the last book it means we are having books in multiple rows but the design is still not looking good now we need to provide a little bit gap in the books and for that we can use the margin and i want to keep the margin of five pixel now it is looking good but there is one more change that we can make the books are aligned in the left side we can place them in the center of the page and for that we can write the css over here let's verify the changes on the browser also so this time you will see we are having all the books in the center of the page here you can see we are having the books in the center if i want to update the width of a particular card i can update them over here let's say i'm making it 400 here also I'm making it 400 just save the changes go back to the browser and this time you will see we are having only two card in one single row because because the width is extra and we cannot place three cards in one single row so let's test few more things let's say I'm making it 350 let's update the 350 over here also and this time it is looking good the page is full we are having only three books in one single row and again this design will be responsive so if i'm having a mobile view you can see we are having all the books in a particular column so this ui is completely responsive